Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us continue with the next question. So basically, this question is a continuation question of the previous question, guys. Okay? Yes. So consider a completely undirected graph with the vertex as a 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. So 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. So they give the weights of them. Okay. So with entries, a W, I, J in the matrix, a W belongs to the weights of the edges in between I, J. Okay. So what is the minimum possible weight of a path for vertex 1 to 2. Okay, so we are trying to travel from 1 to 2. Okay, in the in this graph, such that P contains at most 3 edges. Okay, so at max you can have, in between 1 and 2, you can have at max 3 edges. So what is the minimum cost? So if you recall, we have already drawn the minimum spanning tree for this, right? So if you recall, I will be just showing you that image, guys. So if you recall, this is the image, guys, for that. Okay, so if you just observe, so what is the path which we followed here guys? So what is we are searching? So 1 to 2 we are searching. So here we traveled 1 to 3, 3 to 4 and 4 to 3. So here the total cost is 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So here the cost is a 9 guys. Okay, so anyway let us check uh, is there any minimum cost? So this cost is a 9. Okay, okay. So we have one option that the previous path is a 9 and what is the direct path from 1 to 2? So 1 to 2 the direct path cost is a 12. So if you compare better 12 we, we can go with the previous path. So anyway let us check is there any other shortest path in between 1 and 2. So let us start searching. So from 1 where you can go with the really cheap cost guys to 1 you can go to 0 you can go. So from 1 you can go to 0 with the cost of 1. Okay. So from 0 you need to go somewhere so at the end you should reach 2 okay so let us again search in one row which is the cheapest cost guys so one is, uh, this will be waste right so because you will be traveling in between them only so the next option will be for 3 right okay and you can even also have an option for 4 okay so let us take both the cases so basically first let us take a 3 okay and in some other case i'll be taking 4 guys Okay, that's nothing but 4. So here the cost is 1, here the cost is 4, here the cost is 1. So my goal is to reach 2, right? Yes. So from 3, can I reach 2? So what is the cost? 7 is the cost, okay? So 7 will be the cost and I can reach 2. So what is the total cost here, guys? 7, 8 and 9. So here also again the cost is 9. So we are having two possibilities for 9. So let us continue this path now. So from 4, can I reach 2, guys? So from 4, can I reach 2? Yes, the cost is 3. Okay, this seems to be cheap. Okay, so I can reach 2. So what is this cost guys? So 4 plus 1 is a 5, 5 plus 3 is 8. So I think 8 is the minimum cost, right? So you can try some more combinations. So in this way, slowly if you construct some small, small examples, slowly you can understand the thing guys. So basically 8 is the shortest, shortest minimum distance guys, okay? Yes. So I hope everyone got a clear idea, right? Yes. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question, okay? Yes. So let us meet the next lecture. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.